Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today we are here with the November Ipsy Glam Bag Plus review and re what? Hi, Kitty. Oh, you're so distracting. Reveal and review. Haha. -ha. Let you know that I'm not actually trying on any of the products in this video. What are you doing? Are you coming in? Okay, so apparently this is featuring Peach because I'm distracted and he's probably gonna start screaming soon, so I apologize now. Anyway, so I will be talking about the products. I did try one thing off camera, but nothing will, will actually be on camera right now, so that's fine. If you are interested in Ipsy, my referral link will be in the description box down below. Glam Bag Plus is 25 bucks a month and you get five full-size products sent to you. They now offer an option to pick three of the five products and now I remember oh shit guys I'm sorry I forgot that I wanted to screen record my choice this month okay so there's hope for next month <laughs> maybe if I set a reminder if I remind myself to remind myself I'm doing that right now so let's hope for next month that you can actually see the choices if you're like oh my god I can't even do 25 bucks a month for 12 bucks a month you get five sample size products sent to you and it is so worth it because not only do you get that each month there are constant flash sales and the ipsy shop that's available to you all the time and if you keep your eyes on it there are some severe, like heavily discounted products available to you i've saved a lot of money overall and i only get the things that i need when i when i'm running low on moisturizer or a hand cream and what's really convenient about ipsy is i have an app on my phone Ta-da! Where I can access everything. And then as you review products, you get points. The more points you get, you can actually redeem more products. So it's it's just a win-win. This month's bag is super freaking cute. I love it. I gotta say, since they've switched over to these bags, I'm feeling less inclined to get rid of them and finding like more of a reason to like have a use for it, you know? I don't know if any of you guys heard, but Ipsy bought Boxy Charm. We'll see what happens. Ipsy's really been consumer based. I've had Boxy Charm long enough where there's definitely there's definitely a completely different vibe. So I, I hope that in moving forward that it's just going to get better. I hope it doesn't get worse. I really hope my fingers are freaking crossed. So I'm just gonna jump right into it, and yeah, this is what we're this is what we're gonna do. Okay. So first up is this mascara. It's fucking huge, and it came in this. I I, I got rid of all like the cardboard packaging and stuff that that came with it, just because it's it just takes up too much space. But it was very bougie. Um, but the Trusty Good Vibes Mascara and Lash Curler. Oh, that's probably what that is. I guess I didn't read. <laughs> Go figure. In Iceland, I. Atlantic black lacquer. So the retail value, $25 for this bad boy. So this, this is worth what I paid for the freaking box. One product. Okay. You get my, get my drift here. Two in one curler and mascara, blah, blah, blah. One end has a small eyelash curler. Perfect for getting those short lashes and the, and the other an inky black mascara. Oh boy. <sighs> Yeah, so I'm obviously not trying this today. I have other mascaras on backup that I'm waiting to open because I, I don't want to have a million products open at once. So this will be in a first impressions get ready with me and I'm pretty sure hell will be paid or something. Like, I don't know, like that. It sounds like a great idea, but I know me. It's not going to be good. <laughs> Ugh. Anyway, moving on. I actually don't have this with me because I gave it away, but the Seraphine Botanicals, I will insert a picture. Beautiful palette. Uh, Sakura, Sakura? What the fuck kind of, what, what? What? I can't read. In Sage Vegan Eyeshadow and Blush Palette. This retails at $42. Whether you're going subtle or soft glam, six shimmery and matte shadows plus two blushes. Blah, blah, blah. Use your fingers or a brush to blend each shade. Oh God, no, don't use your fingers. It's talc free, that's cool. Anyway, so yeah, I gave that to my cousin Alicia. I saw, I saw the color the color palette and the fact that I'm like, I have so many freaking palettes and it just screamed Alicia's face. So I gave that to her and she loves it. And I will say that it's a lot bigger than what I expected it to, it to be. And I just like kept laughing at it because I'm like, Jesus Christ. All right, so up next is the Murad Retinol Youth Renewal Night Cream. This is a big bitch. Oh, 
its retail value is $82. <laughs> this potent night cream doesn't mess around when it comes to anti-aging. It smooth softens, hydrates, and plumps too. It plumps? I don't need help with plumping. I do that on my own. Hello cheeseburgers. Gentle time release form of retinol. Yeah, blah blah blah. I will not be opening this just yet. I need to finish my other moisturizer first before I open this. Basically, wait a few months and this might be in the in my empties video. Like, I'm not sure. But I've used Murad products before and I really enjoy Murad products. So there's that. Da da da! Tula skincare. I love the pa I love the packaging on this. Anything that's like super shiny, I'm like, ooh, squirrel. These are the I <laughs> I feel amazing cooling and brightening hydrogel eye mask set of four. I only have two with me. I gave one to Alicia, just you know, because why not? And I used one today. I freaking love these. These are so much better than the uh, other eye eye masks that I still have. They're from Boxy Charm. They're like gold. Can't remember what the heck they were called, but. These actually stayed in place, and they're awesome. This retails at $22. Uh, hydrate, brighten, and refresh your eye area for instant awake feeling. This is true. We leave them on for 20 minutes, and my phone is freaking the fuck out. Yeah, so there's that. Expect those to be in next month's empties, because I'm gonna be using those by the end of this week. <laughs> oh my goodness. So I'm so nervous about this. So this is by Flesh. It's Touched Fle Touch Flesh Highlighter Balm and Startle. This retails for $18. Sheer Luminous Highlighter brings a candlelit glow to your skin. Balm-like formula glides effortle effortlessly on bare skin or over foundation to get you a lit from within look. So, I'd have to apply this before I set my face. Interesting. I, uh, I'm gonna try it. I don't know if I'm gonna like it, but that's okay. It's fine. The last three items are add-ons. So another thing that Ipsy does is once you choose your products, you can then choose your add-ons, which they have everything from full-size products. You pay like $12 or $18, but like you could be getting like a $100 moisturizer for like 18 bucks and it's like, holy shit. But they also have $3 sample size products and I have three sample size products. Always, always try to find a hand cream because these are perfect for putting in any of your purses on the go. It's genius. You're fucking welcome. So this is the Barefoot Venus, the Vanilla Effect Instant Hand Repair. Hydrating hand cream, delicious scent, rich vanilla mixed with floral jasmine, and lily of the valley. Give any perfume a run for, okay, so this is definitely gonna be scented. Immediate moisturizing relief, nourishing blend of mango and shea butters, plus olive and soybean oils. I'm just a little shook at what's written in here because I'm wondering if it's because of the, uh, I don't know, the oils in here. I'm not gonna, I don't think I'm ever gonna do this. But it says, accidentally used too much hand cream? Try this hack. Rub the excess between your palms and then run them over the surface of your hair to smooth flyaways. Sorry bro, but I'm not fucking putting lotion in my hair. No, I ain't doing it. Get the fuck out of here. Next. <laughs> I've used this before and I just, it's its so little and so cute and it, it's fine. The Tarte Double Duty Shape Tape Concealer in Fair Neutral. I have used this before, like I said. Full coverage concealer, a go-to, instantly bright, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, it, like it's super brightening and it's fucking thick. Matte finish formula. Blend, <laughs> blendable buildable. You don't need to build on this, honey. One swipe and you're fucking done. Like, unless they change the fucking formula. And lastly, which I'm so excited, this is my first time, well, this is my first time using like a hefty sample. The other sample is like a one and done, so like does it really count? I don't know. But this is the Tatcha, the Deep Cleanse Cleanser. Yay, I know it's little, but I'm so excited. Gentle Daily Cleanser. I did use this and it's fucking awesome. There is some kind of nostalgic scent to it and I cannot place what the heck it is, but whatever, it's fine. Oil-free gel formula, lathers into a creamy foam. Yes, can confirm. It almost has like an exfoliation in it that's like really gentle because it was like a little bumpy, but it doesn't it doesn't identify as an exfoliator. Uh, two Japanese plant extracts, wild rose and leopard lily. Mmm. Oh. Ha <laughs> ha! So maybe it does, I just read further. Not only does it clean, it gently ex exfoliates too. Okay, thanks. I'm done now. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that being said, we are at the end of this video. $25. Plus, I mean, the three the three sample products, so with an extra nine, 
but full retail value is this. Yes, future me does math. Mm. Totally freaking worth it. So if you are interested in trying Ipsy, check the description box for my referral link. Go ahead and go to their website. All of the information is there. Hallelujah. Holy shit. Where's the Tylenol? Totally quoted a movie. It's fine. Thank you so much for sticking around and watching this video. Be sure to like and subscribe. And until the next one.